Hello, I'm Adam with Inspiration Builders standing here in our Belmont Heights subdivision. As you can tell, it's an absolutely stunning subdivision. I mean, look at the views here. You got Rattlesnake Mountain in the background and the fields below. And you can see all the way out to the Hanford Reservation with the Richland Water Tower and the Hanford or the Horn Rapids Golf Course. Great views, beautiful subdivision. It's just starting to take off. We do have lots left. Um, just but we're really starting to take contracts so come on out on our weekends and and check out our model home we're standing outside of this model home 539 athens drive here in west richland did a stucco design with a pretty traditional outside you did the planter shelf up above with the architrave header did the perimeter uh, uh, perimeter grids on the window pattern got our belly band here as we walk up here, you'll notice this rock, and I just love this rock. It's a ledge of cut stone that we used. It's really white with a little bit of gray through it. Has a really, really cool accent with the colors that we chose here. So we walk up here, here's our modern style front door with our four panes of glass all done in rain glass to create that privacy. I think it's about an eight or nine on the privacy. We have the matching windows on the side that have that privacy rain glass too. To um, so that they can't see in but it still creates this beautiful entryway and we have that uh, Chandelier up above and that chandelier really pops especially during night when you're driving by you can see that through that big window up there As we walk here into our foyer area uh, Take our boots off put this little bench in here for staging purposes We've got our repost gray on the wall with our extra white trim package did a a more of a traditional style trim on this just to kind of show some detail and stuff. I'd like to change it up here or there instead of just doing kind of the same stuff to show it. We've got our five panel door. We use that quite a bit. Got your entryway closet for all your coats and storage needs. Um, and you can see that chandelier up above and the cool reflections it does on the ceiling here. So, uh, got my boys here. They're here. Uh, out of school because of the Veterans Day, so just wanted to say thank you so much for all the veterans out there. Uh, just we have the ability to do you know this amazing job and stuff like this because of your guys' service. So thank you so much. And as we walk into the living room here, you'll notice the cabinets we did right here with our two shelves up above and our countertop. Got that uh, pattern kind of carpet down below. Got our uh, tile all the way up the face of our fireplace. Looks really cool. It's a texture and it's got a cool color and sheen to it. Um, got our uh, fireplace with our standard blower in it. Really puts out quite a bit of heat. Really love these fireplaces. Um, and as we step back here, you see this mill guard fully uh, sliding glass door that opens up. Um, and this is a 10 footer. You can go all the way to 12. And I mean, these just are cool, especially if you got a really, really good view because it's just a wall of glass. You notice up above we did the full surround sound system uh, and we did that out on the covered patio as well with a separate volume control so you can kind of control the volume inside and outside. We did the uh, uh, ceiling fan pre-wire in here with controls. The controls are over on the wall and the ceiling fan is pre-wired so you can add a ceiling fan if you'd like. We carried tile throughout the entryway here in the kitchen nook area and here's your kitchen nook area. Went ahead and did kind of a matching chandelier to that front chandelier, kind of tie it all together and have that reflective uh, pattern on the ceiling. And we did 10 foot plate in this whole main area, so everything in here is 10 feet, really opens the room up. So you come into the kitchen, you'll kind of notice that we did an espresso cabinet this time, been doing white a lot lately, so did an espresso cabinet with a, a bright white quartz countertops, very nice count, uh, quartz countertop here. And as we blend in here, you got this backsplash, and you really, you know, it's just a really cool backsplash you can see through, and you know, it's got a cool pattern to it with that grout that has a, uh, like a glitter flake to it. So, I'm not sure if you can see that with that LED light, it really, really, really pops. And then up above, we got our glass uppers that we added there with that LED light. Just kind of dress it up, give you the ability to, you know, showpiece some. Uh, different things you know you may have like antiques or China or stuff like that I know my mom always had stuff like that so gives that ability to kind of display some stuff Christmas decorations Thanksgiving decorations all that stuff um, as you step over to the island you know our stainless steel package here that stainless steel farm sink you got our mowing pull-out faucet here tons of pressure up here a really nice piece 
Got our refrigerator right here, and then this steps into our pantry. Nice, good sized pantry. We always, we always paint all of our pantries white just to make them bright and light. We have a bigger LED light up above, so it really just makes it bright in here. And as we step over here, here's the mud room slash uh, washing room. So, got your little locker system here. You can sit down, take your boots or shoes off, put them underneath. Got additional storage up above. You got your coat hangers right here as well. And then you got room for your washer and dryer over here with your upper cabinets for additional storage. And as we, as we step out here, we get into the garage area. If you've watched these before, it's a pretty standard garage. We finish them all off. So it has your sheetrock and your uh, insulation all finished. You got your uh, furnace up above from Chinook heating and air, your 95. Well, this is actually not a gas. So, uh, your uh, furnace provided by Chinook heating and air. And we hang those on our one story, so you got lots of room in here. Uh, we got our uh, lift master, um, Wi Fi enabled. Uh, garage door openers with our fully insulated garage doors and our plain light glass um, up against uh, the garage doors there. And as we step through here, you see our silver strand with kind of our uh, wood plank tile here. Oh, and this is cool too. On the back here, you can uh, add this extra set of cabinets to the back for additional storage and make this uh, island a 4x8 versus a 3x8. Step back into here is the first bedroom been using this as a model home so it kind of has all of our stuff in here um, so this is a pretty standard bedroom got our by bypass doors right here for your closet we got this little linen closet right here we tucked in next to the bed bathroom gives you that little added storage down here you got your silver strand and you walk in you'll notice that we went ahead and did a tile accent around this um, tub so and it's really cool it's got a wavy pattern with a gray kind of grain through there with that extra bright um, white grout line and we use this kind of pewter subway tile and it really pops out of there especially with the light got our Kohler toilets here and we have this two, 2050 window added for allowing some airflow and also natural light again we did that espresso cabinet Beautiful cabinet line, plywood box off our dovetail drawer, soft closed doors. Got that quartz countertop, that Moen Eva line series with that kind of pewter subway tile there with your square undermount sink. Got your bar light up above. If you walk here, this is the other bedroom, so it's the second bedroom. Good sized bedroom. We've got our window seals over here with those triple pane ply gem windows. Um, got a nice good sized closet right there. When we go out here, we'll go ahead and head over to the master. So, go to the master bedroom. And uh, we got our office up front. It's a great size office. Oh, almost went by. So we got our Honeywell Pro Series thermostat provided by Chinook Heating and Air. Um, here's the office area. It's a huge office, so I mean, obviously you could make this a fourth bedroom if you needed it for a bedroom so we could easily add a closet in here great size and it's also a, like a gymnasium you can do you know you can practice your taekwondo right taekwondo right or your break dancing either way so walking into here you got your pre-wire for your ceiling fan up above you got your tray ceiling with your rope light for that accent piece Great size master bedroom right here. Uh, you got your 5050 opening window right there. And as you walk into here, this is the master bathroom. We got double sinks, square undermount sinks. Um, we got our drawers, lots of cabinet space on this. Love this white quartz, that Mo and Eva line series and that pewter backsplash. And right up to the side here, we got our separate uh, toilet area with our Kohler toilets right here and that silver strand flooring. And you can see this beautiful tub right here. Love these tubs by Max. Nice and deep. Kind of got some armrests here even, even on the side. So got a little armrest there. You can go like this. Got our nice big uh, Eva Moan Line series right there. Nice full six foot tub makes it 
most people could probably fit in. Got your 404 obscured window there for some natural light. You got your linen closet here for extra storage. And then over here we did do the pewter accent. We carried that wavy kind of tile here with the with the gray um, with the gray kind of vein running through here. And it's really, really a beautiful tile. So you get your LED light up above and as you come into the master closet. You got your five pack right here. This closet lays out very well. You got doubles, doubles, five pack here, doubles, 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 doubles. Single, you got this drawer system. This drawer system is really handy. Basically, it takes away from needing a dresser system. Then you have this mirror up against the wall so you can kind of check to see. See the mirror, Matt? Got the mirror on the wall so you can kind of see. Oh, looking good for the day. Tucked in. Everything looks good. So that's a 2250 square foot plan three bedroom with a den office, three car garage. So um, thank you for watching.